And in between that time, Jess Ennis has lost her world outdoor crown to Chernova. Big battle ahead here today. Jess Ennis looks tiny compared with some of these athletes. Talia Dobrinska in lane six. Austra Skoyute of Lithuania in seven. Time, 7.99 by the American Tiffany Lott Hogan in 2004. This is a little bit of history that you're watching here. And Jessica Rennie is so close to a personal best at this distance, but the best she's ever produced in a pentathlon. And that is the ideal start. Nerves, forget it. Psychologically, the first box is ticked. Bolshova never got out, would have helped, the, would have helped the, the Russian next to her, Chernova, not react, to, you know, at the same time. So it was really that played into Jess's hands too. She looks so smooth though, just look at the replay of the hurdles. I think obviously, as we said before, she's here because she knows she's in sh Jessica Ennis, the high jump, that's coming up after the break. Heptathletes usually have 30 minutes between events. Um, so obviously, so warming up, they're just warming up now. It looked like there was a, f Jess was talking to a few officials. I don't know what about, maybe it was just a bar hike. Jessica Ennis, just getting ready. High jump is going to be going soon, and we promise you, you won't miss a moment of Jessica Ennis's quest for another gold medal here. And she's made the dream start with that victory in the 60 meters hurdles. Talk about start. She got an absolutely blistering start, which I'm sure you'll be watching again at some stage through the day. But Jessica Ennis with the bar at 175. Well, she came in a bit earlier than many of us expected. Got a nice clearance at her opening height in the high jump section of this pentathlon. She's looking up to coach Tony Minicello. It was a nice first time clearance then at one meter and 75 for Jess Ennis lead. Well, she had such a tremendous start early on in those 60 meter hurdles, 7.91 seconds, 1,150 points for the defending champion. She looks cool. Coach Tony looks cool. A nice clearance at 1 meter 75. And another nice clearance for Jess Ennis. Well, she may have come into this high jump competition, this part of the pentathlon, earlier than many expected, Dean. But she's looking very, very smooth. And it's good to see she's taking all of these jumps. 75 and 85 are relatively low for her. Probably wouldn't normally look at them, but with the, the issues that we thought she had or we think she had in warm up. Jessica Ennis, her first attempt at 1 meter and 81. Well, the bar's going up higher, I promise you. Watching at home, she's making it look so easy. She's clearing these heights wonderfully. And one meter and 81 for Jessica Ennis, the number one in the top right corner.